I was then in my early 40s, a time when many people go through a midlife crisis. But rather than a midlife crisis, I decided to come to India, which provoked a crisis of sorts for me as well. That was, this was a turning point in my life, in that though I had been engaged in the study of religion for more than two and a half decades, this was, this coming to India gave me a, an experience, a living experience of the great religious traditions of humanity. So rather than just reading about them, rather than just studying them, trying to understand their teaching, their doctrine, and their practice, their ritual, and so on and so forth, all of the things that we as scholars of religion do, it was an opportunity for me to spend time in the various religious communities of India. My children uh, often made fun of me. Actually, at the end of our year in India, we had, uh, I had agreed with my wife that uh, if she would come to India with me, I would agree that on the way home we would spend two months in Italy, which is uh, one of her favorite places on the earth. And uh, we did that. Uh, Emma, who was only four at the time, and is here with us uh, today, uh, and Lucas, who was then eight, as well as Jessica, who was 15, and Ben, who was 18, they were all with me on this journey. And we spent time in 